aspect that's important to you and why is it also important to you to have kids looking up to you as an athlete and as a human being? Well, my, part my partnership with First Bank uh, has been going on for two years and the first time they approached me with this idea of the um, grants for the children, I thought it was a really great idea because here in Puerto Rico, um, first of all, we have three key sports that are baseball, basketball, and boxing, and tennis isn't very common, so when a kid you know, wants to play tennis, obviously tennis isn't a very cheap sport, it's very expensive, so in order to give um, these kids the opportunity to chase their dreams, whether it be to be in my position or to be a Grand Slam winner one day, we have to give them the means to be able to do so, so I really thank First Bank for, for helping me and collaborating with me on this idea, and uh, you know, I see so many young kids here, there's three that we gave their first grants to, and then there's another group of three, so this has already been six kids who we've helped, you know, chase their dreams and hopefully in the future you know they can look back on this uh, when they're successful um, you know in their lives and, and just say that this was like a stepping stone for them and it's very important you know to give uh, to give and encourage children to, to live their dreams. You mentioned before during the press conference the importance of having the seed funding you know to be able to participate to buy your equipment and all of that. Did you have that growing up? Well, it was very difficult for me, obviously, growing up. Um, I wasn't an only child, so I had my brother, and he had his dreams. He played baseball, and, you know, it was very difficult, but I did have, you know, the support of, um, especially the PRTA helped me out when I was younger, and it really helped, you know, helping get the equipment, uh, the training, um, the traveling to tournaments, and it's really important because, like I said, tennis is very costly, and sometimes, you know, you have to sacrifice maybe a tournament or a practice or this and that because you just don't have the means to do so, so hopefully this gives these kids the opportunity to, to not have to say no to their dreams and to not have to hold back because I feel like, you know, the dreams of the child are very important and they're going to pave the way for the future. So if you have these six kids standing in front of you, what do you say to them? Well, I, I hope that they, you know, follow their dreams and don't let anybody push them down because they're special and each one of their dreams is special and each one of them is unique. So I hope that with this grant and with this opportunity that we're giving them, they can believe in themselves enough to, um, to, to live out their dream. Thank you.